Hey YouTube, Country Boy Prepper here. Back in 1993 when the first assault weapons ban kicked in, I was 12 years old and I was just getting into firearms. I was just falling in love with them. I never really got into to comic books, but every time my mom would take me to the grocery store, I was always reading gun magazines and buying gun magazines. I had a huge box full of them. And uh, of course that was back before we really had YouTube and the internet so that was my main source for learning about firearms in general and I just really began to fall in love with them back in that time that was when it all kind of began for me and as you know right at that time was when that assault weapons ban kicked in and these these uh, standard capacity magazines were, were banned and uh, for, for a 10 year period and I was I remember being just totally furious about it and angry and frustrated and and uh disappointed that i would never be able to to own some of these awesome firearms and, and magazines that i really wanted to get i remember they were selling at gun shows for like a hundred dollars for a pre-band magazine and i just i hated it and so i think uh because of that <laughs> uh now i i have um I, I have this thing about never having enough magazines I, i've i've always just never felt like I had enough magazines and I always buy magazines whether I need them or not so because of that I've ended up with quite a few magazines I've got tons of AR magazines I've got quite a few uh, Glock 9mm magazines and uh, I think I got some more in here but anyway I've always kind of used these military ammo cans to store my ammunition and my magazines uh, I like to keep them o-ring sealed, I like the durability of them, and I still like them, but recently I've found a little bit better method that I want to share with you guys uh, for keeping them a little bit better organized and, and, um, and protected. And uh, it's two different products, one of them is this uh, MCM Case Guard Tactical Mag Can. Uh, I'm sure you all have seen these online or maybe at Academy, they're about 21 bucks on uh, Optics Planet. And um, they're a polymer can, they're o-ring sealed, they're fairly durable, they're lockable, uh, nice handle on top. And uh, they've got these foam inserts with these slots in here, and uh, they hold your AR-15 magazines just like so. And this is how I usually store mine in this, it holds 15 of them at a time. Uh, when I take this to the range and I, and I shoot a mag up, I'll just flip it over so I know it's empty, and uh, keep it uh, the bullets up when it's full. And uh, you can actually cram a few more in here if you want to. There's, uh, there's slots right here in the front, in the middle, in the back. And uh, you can actually put 19 loaded magazines in here total, just like that. And fits just fine. And uh, you can still have access to your, to your magazines. Doesn't, doesn't impede anything. So uh, I like to do that as well. That holds, so it holds 19 magazines fully loaded. And that's quite a bit of ammo if you want to just take this and throw it in your trunk or back to your truck or whatever. And you'll know that your, your magazines are sealed up with O-rings, they're protected, and you got quite a bit of ammo on tap ready to go. Uh, it's also really nice for, for, you know, if you want to store it at a bug out location or, or just grab it and t t take it to the range. So um, anyway, uh, you can also use a code at Optics Planet to get 5% off. Uh, Country 5. Uh, we'll get you five percent off they also have free shipping on these so basically you can get them for i think right under 20 bucks if you want to get them uh, which is not bad i think uh, another product that i got is this um these foam inserts for the military cans for my for my pistol mags i think this company is called case club and i found them on amazon i'll put a link for both of these products in the description below but as you can see it's just a foam insert similar to the uh, mcm product and uh get, goes into a 30 caliber military ammo can and it holds uh, 10 Glock magazines very nicely. These are 17 round mags and 15 round mags and they fit in there very nicely. Uh, there's a there's a, a piece right here that, that keeps the, the lid protected so that if they slide up they don't rattle or bump or anything. There's a foam piece in the bottom. Basically I just took some Gorilla Glue and just glued all this into the can so it's permanent. This doesn't come off, this isn't coming out and um, works really nice. Uh, these are um, I think these are like 12 or 13 bucks uh, for this one. They make another one uh, for the 50 caliber can that holds like 24 mags, I believe it is, and it's like it's like closer to 15 bucks. And they also make one that has like a slot for your pistol to slide into with rows of mags on the left as well. Uh, I'll roll some pictures in and show you all those, but um, really like these two products. Just really make your life simpler, keep things more organized. When you get as many mags as I've got. 
Uh, it's easy to just lose mags and leave them laying somewhere and next thing you know you just got mags stashed everywhere and you don't know where everything is and they get damaged. You just It's just hard to keep up with them honestly. <laughs> I've got mags in, in packs, I've got mags in, in, in mag carriers and plate carriers and ammo cans and rolling around on the back of my truck you know you know how it is <laughs> anyway but um i just thought i'd share this with y'all real quick and i uh, thought y'all might be interested uh check these two products out and uh this is also made in the usa very cool and um check them out thanks for watching guys